Just a few months old. Oh, here's the police. Did point this in our falconry uh, dog show just now. But she wants to catch him. It's the whole essence of this. It's like a cat stalking a mouse or a, a sheep dog eyeing its sheep. It really wants to grab hold of it. Now, chop with this out here. This wing was flickering about so much, it was really winding her up. chance of me talking away behind her and the different things going on in the ring but you get the idea and you'd normally be out on the moor kind of rough ground doing this and they would smell it they'd be running at full pelt and she would just smell that tucked in the stubbles just in a bit of heather and they freeze now you could have two or three working together and they run up they see one doing it and the others will run up to them and just back, what we'll call back, make a little traffic jam behind them. And they'll hold that position, maybe for 20 minutes or more. I, should, I, I can't keep that there in front of her much longer, I think, because the wind is just flipping a feather right up under her nose. And believe me, she will start. I'm going to have to pull this out of her hands because I don't want her to start getting into the habit of learning that she can grab it. So I'm going to flick it out. But these are very popular now, these Hungarian breeds, but German pointers. Lots of breeds now from abroad, which um, have been around for probably about 50 years, the original ones, the, the first type of ones, which were German pointers, I believe I've never seen them again. Points are but generally you don't have them for retrieving. These dogs also can make very adequate retrievers, so they're what we we'll call hunt so, um, but she's really quite a nice one. So I'm glad she does it. She may do it tomorrow. She may never do it again. Okay, let's try and look at that. Just like a cobra. Just went and pulled that.